sing and I also play, well, I play bass also for the big one. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys just received a whole lot of not too long ago, so how was that? It was really great. It came out about a month and a half ago, and we plan on touring the whole U.S. coming out this year. Mm -hmm. Random fact, it actually came out on the Oh, really? Oh, really? Yeah. Awesome. Sweet. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, um, what's your favorite song? You can answer first. I don't know. Well, I'll, I'll go for it. Yeah, you should. I like, um, I like a song called Get Lost on it. Um, just stylistically. That one's probably tied with skinny jeans. It's like a, almost like a country kind of ballad that's on it right here. But uh, I like both those songs. I like uh, that kind of girl. I think on that kind of girl, I think a lot of different stuff that I like. So, um, if you could do anything, besides what you like Besides the band? Yeah. I want to be a manager. Yeah. Because I, I, I like I to see that stuff get done. He's also like a big like control freak. Like sometimes I think it'd be like, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> like he's always like harassing our managers anyway. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Not everything. So if you could just control everything, you'd be a lot happier. Manager. I don't think I could ever get away with yeah. music. I'd probably either be mixing or uh, I don't know. I don't think I could do anything on the band besides just be pressing. But yeah, I love recording and mixing and everything like that. But I've done literally every crappy job in the world. Mm -hmm. so. So, um, what is your biggest guilty pleasure? What's that? Your guilty pleasure. Guilty pleasure? I like Astro Simpson. Oh, music-wise? Anything. Just anything. anything. Oh. That's a pleasure. Like a candy, candy. Uh, a creepy sandwich. I was like a big sci-fi dork growing up. I like, oh. love Star Wars. I know, I like a trivia whiz and all that stuff. Yeah, like all three. The original movies, I don't know anything about the new ones with Hayden, uh, Christians or whatever it is. I don't know anything about that. I'm going to be honest. Yeah, I, I mean, here's some history. Well, that's not guilty. I, 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 I know, I love it. Well, yeah, I just, I, I know more episodes than I should. I can probably recite every single one. So, okay. Um, if you could sum up Tori in just four words, what would you say? Are you asking me the fingers on this one? Where should we park? <laughs> <laughs> Where should we eat? There it is. <laughs> That's pretty much all we worry about. Yep. <laughs> yeah, today we got lucky. We parked in that garage. Yeah. Because we're not as lucky. Like, I don't see any of the parked here. So that'd be cute. Here's really hard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah. So, um, has there been any, like, embarrassing moments? Embarrassing moments? Um, yeah. Well, everywhere, well, everywhere you go, but it, it depends on if you let it get to you, because you get at least five or six times a day, like, weird looks. It pisses me off like weird looks. You guys in a band or something? Like, everywhere we go. We're going to, like, count them on one tour. <laughs> see how many times we hear. Are you guys in a band? Yeah. But, um, yeah. Other than that, you weren't there when we had a big one. Uh, we had one show. I think it was in Texas, but literally, like, it, well, everything went wrong. It's like we missed a song counting completely. Topher like fell completely off stage, like seven feet down. It was like an overall. I'm surprised it was like, okay. Yeah, he was fine. I mean, it's on YouTube if you search for it. It's just yeah. uh, bigger lights uh, falls, falls off stage. Yeah, yeah like the that. bigger lights falls off stage. Yeah. You'll be able to find it. Uh, so, um, have there been any friends on the Uh, not this one yet. Day number two of the game three is going to on. On the last tour, we were out with Ann Arbor and this province foundation, and we took like I think Ann Arbor is known for like smoking. They, yeah, doing some they're drugs. peaceful dudes. <laughs> yeah, they, they, they're like kind of hippies, you know. Yeah, they're yeah, yeah, yeah. marijuana, so like we, we decided it'd be really funny if we like rolled up like a plant, like a sheep. It was a tree. Like we found a tree yeah, in the like green a like ceramic, and down. we rolled it in a white sheet. And then, like, lit at the end. And everybody walked on stage with it. Yeah. And we're passing it around. Yeah, we're <laughs> kind of The funniest thing was to watch people who didn't get it. Like, yeah. so what was with the tree? <laughs> <laughs> really funny. But, yeah, there's always the classics, like, take away the drums. Or, we had three men come up on stage and uh, play artists' poet songs and, like, the wrong key. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, you know, it was two green men yeah. and a gorilla. Yeah, yeah, gorilla. Were you one of the green men? No. Topher was. Topher was. And David Blazer was probably the other green man. 
Who was the good one? At least I think he was David Blaze's Green Man. Like, he won't ever admit if he's Green Man or not. Yeah, he takes on another persona when he's Green Man. (laughs) We're going to have Green Man video updates coming really soon. Hey, son, you.